Toyota killed off the Land Cruiser in America in 2021, opting not to bring the new J300 model over but you can still get it in Lexus form. We, like many, had a soft spot for the big friendly SUV. The trouble was, no one here bought it. The Land Cruiser was too bloated and too inefficient, and, at nearly $90,000, it priced out Toyota SUV enthusiasts but wasn't a fancy enough badge for those who paid that much for an SUV. Toyota has not announced that the Land Cruiser nameplate will be returning to America yet. However, they notably are not ruling it out. Jack Hollis, head of Toyota's North American sales, told it was, likely, the Land Cruiser nameplate would return at some point though there wasn't anything to announce yet. Sooner than you may think. TFL, citing a Toyota source, reported that the Land Cruiser nameplate will return to America for the 2024 model year. It won't be the J300 model. It will be the new version of the smaller, cheaper Land Cruiser Prado currently sold in America as the Lexus GX. Rumors on the Japanese site Creative Trends say the Land Cruiser Prado will be renamed the Land Cruiser 250 for the next generation. Their timeline has the model release being delayed until April 2024 but does note that it could be bound for North America. Yes, this new Land Cruiser would not be the flagship vehicle. It would slot below the new Sequoia and above the 4Runner. The GX, which starts in the $50,000 S, clearly starts at the right price point. Lexus sells around 30,000 of them per year, even though the GX was last overhauled in 2009. The Land Cruiser could be more of an off-roader, hopefully with a better approach angle than the GX which would then free up the Lexus GX to be more luxurious and Lexus-like. The 4Runner would presumably slot beneath the Land Cruiser with the 275 horsepower 2.4-liter 4-cylinder gas engine as a base powertrain. If Toyota does have top-secret Land Cruiser return plans, it would explain why the new 4Runner appears to be so delayed.